What's up, guys? It's the U2 Rocker. That is the space where I will eventually leave my super awesome catchphrase, and you are watching some Brink gameplay. And by the title of this video, I'm sure I'm getting flamed by Brink fanboys, but I don't know how that's even possible because Brink is not a good game. I bought the game actually back in June. I was just driving around town one day. And I had watched all the little gameplay trailers leading up to it, and I was just like, Oh yeah, this game's awesome. Teamwork, you got customization, little parkour elements, it's gonna be great. I walked into GameStop, and I'm like, hell yeah, give me it. Paid 60 bucks for it. Worst $60 I have ever spent. I think I bought it in the first week of June, and I haven't played it since the first week of June. Uh, the reason why you, <laughs> the reason why you're seeing it on screen right now is because it was free to play on Steam this weekend, and I was like, ah, oh, whatever. I don't think downloading it on PC will make its sucktitude go away, but why not? And some DLC also came out over Xbox Live, which is free, so I might go play that uh, on Xbox maybe this weekend. But it's just, <sighs> I have no idea. Why, like, if someone asked me why I didn't like Brink, I probably couldn't give them a very good answer. But it just didn't come together very well. I played through uh, the single player, which is hardly a single player. It's like one cutscene, and then you have terribly made cutscenes in between every match, and then you just play the multiplayer maps with brain dead idiot bots. Which is not a good thing when a game is so team focused and you can only win if you work as a team uh, in Brink and having these bots that are freaking brain dead did not no it was not good and so I kinda suffered through that and I said oh maybe it'll get better in the multiplayer no it didn't just the way the game actually controls on consoles at least the PC it's a little better it's a little more responsive, and I'm pretty sure they've patched it a few more times on PC than Xbox. Don't quote me on that, though. It's just that the way it plays just doesn't feel right, and it doesn't feel very smooth. And it has lots of good elements, that, and they just don't come together very well. I don't know if it was like a personal thing, or I personally don't have the right mindset to enjoy it. I thought I would. I'm a huge Battlefield player, and I'm a good team player, but it's just something about it where the gameplay was fun for a week, maybe, and then you start to see the same things over and over again, the same maps, the same what the hell is going on, why am I dying, why is this not working properly, why is etc, etc. It just it gets repetitive and really annoying, and I don't know. I just... I just didn't enjoy it very much. And that's what it comes down to. Is this game fun? Yes. No. Brink? No. Even Call of Duty. And, you know, the general thing is like, oh, if you like Battlefield, then you must take Call of Duty. Eh, not really. It's annoying, but I can get on and have a lot of fun with my friends, and therefore, it's fun. Brink. Not fun. And I don't know if it's like I didn't have friends to play it with, be mainly because they were smarter than me and didn't impulse buy it uh, like I did, but I don't know. I might pop it in the Xbox this weekend, give it another shot, but overall, I think this game had a lot of promise, but it just wasn't executed well. I feel like they could have delayed this game six months, really put good polish on it, tuned up the AI. I, I know there are a lot of bugs. Made the gameplay just flow a bit smoother. And then I think it could have been really awesome. Awesome, And I'm sure they've got a little cult following. And I'm sure they've got plans for a sequel. But I just, yeah, I did not find myself enjoying the game very much. But I do want to know what you guys think. If you played Brink, uh, what you thought about it. Did you like it? Did you hate it? You thought it was okay? They could fix a lot of things. Let me know. Let me know what you thought of it. Uh, but I personally, not a very big fan. It had its ups, but the downs heavily, heavily outweighed the ups. So that's it for this little commentary. Thanks for tuning in. 
Uh, until next next time, guys, we will talk later. Peace.